Now let's understand how API and YouTube API key works. Go to API and services, click on library, and search for YouTube API. There are many APIs that Google Cloud Platform offers. So we will make new courses, new videos about these uh, APIs later on. So I select it and click on try this. Okay. This is the reference for our APIs. And we have the list. Click on the list because we are getting uh, the list of movies. And here we have a console to the right that allow us to try this API instantaneously. So the HTTP request, of course, will be get because we are getting the data from the server. And we have the parameters here. We have the name, uh, the required parameters part. So we need to specify either the content details or the ID or the snippet. Also, we have filters, the channel ID, the home and mine. Every specify exactly one of the following parameters. So if you if you notice that every uh, every key it is the the return type or the or the type of it would be to the right which is string date time uh, integer boolean also we have an optional parameters maximum result page token published after published before and region code we will uh, see them exactly and on live uh, live uh, on our application so don't worry guys if you don't understand uh, uh, these uh, concepts we will clarify them in the real practice and we will try this avi uh, next minutes so the response would be this and the properties we have the properties here the kind etail next page token previous page token page info and others so the next page token would be a very important so uh, we have the items here and the response would be like this now let's try a live live uh, test i need to get the content details or id or snippet so for the part which is required and it's mandatory so snippet i i will make it as snippet and the channel id i need to get a channel id that i am going to fetch the data from it so i will go to our channel master coding this is our application uh, sorry our channel and i will copy like this uh remember you can browse our uh, youtube channel and I get the channel ID. Now, the maximum results I need to, to, to display to published after published before. I don't need them. I uncheck the Google Auth and I check the API key. I click on execute. There is some error maybe during uh, insufficient credential type. Okay, uh, let me try again. I'll copy this. Okay, everything execute. Okay, we have 200 and here we go. We get the 200, which is successful uh, HTTP request. And we have uh, seen that we are getting all the uh, uh, videos that it is published. And we have page results five, results per page five, and the total results is 20. So we need to uh, uh, invest and we need to uh, make these, uh, uh, take this, uh, uh, take this data and transform them into a real application, into a real 
uh, Android Studio application. So, as I told you, we copy, and you maybe see uh, this this uh, steps uh, in the previous courses. So we copy them and we go to the JSON formatter, and we need to uh, to understand how this hierarchy uh, works. Uh, click on the full screen, and here we go. We have an items here, which is an array of objects, and the array of objects have uh, have uh, details. So I have like this detail, like GPG displaying the thumbnail of the video that master coding on this channel has. So, <clears throat> uh, let me go up, okay, YouTube activity. So, I'm getting the activity for our, uh, uh, for our channel. So, let me go to the Pojo schema. Also, if you, uh, uh, if you watched, the previous courses, you, need, you know about schema and uh, topology, which is <clears throat> generating old Java objects from JSON and JSON format uh, files. So I will copy the JSON formatted data. You can copy from it from here, or you can go to the request, the original request, and I will paste it here. So <clears throat> the target language would be Java, but before I need to add the package here again, master coding and the class name, I will name it as YT model. Make sure that you make a class in the same name. Click on JSON and select annotation style JSON. And everything will work fine. Because I will, uh, I have uh, uh, the yt model class inside the package called models i need to add it here click on preview and generating copy to clipboard this is the the file this is our class the model class for youtube and click on copy to clipboard i will go to android studio I will create, as I told you, inside the model class, I will create a new class called YT model, YT model, and I will paste the code. And now I will remove the errors that it is occurring. I remove this, format this. Okay. Also the same. I remove this. And also I need to remove uh, this package and import. I will import, uh, remove them. Okay. And here we have the annotation also. Removing the package. And we have the master coding app packages, removing them. Also these. And you can remove them exactly like this because we don't need them. I'm just there for purpose of, uh, of lecturing. But I will remove them uh, directly. Okay, and minimizing them. <clears throat> okay, I will go up and remove also here the package and import. Here also. Remove this. Okay, till now we are good. 
I need also to remove this. And one thing, guys, we we need to add them all to YT model. So copy and paste them into inside the YT model. I will repeat this step in order to understand it. So I have in this file we have YT model a class and we have many classes first is high item max rex medium page info and snippet and the standard we need i'm doing it again to, in order to show you exactly where to put your codes so it's very important to understand this i need to put all this data inside the yt model constructor because these are inside the JSON file. So standard, thumbnail, and YT model. YT model, I will copy, I will cut these, cut them, and go to the YT model class and my constructor and paste them at the last line. Okay, so here we go. We have all errors have been successfully removed. There is one error here, the list. I will import the list. Okay. And here we go. We have done it exactly. So we have created the model class for YT model. And everything is working fine. Thank you guys. I hope you rate us five stars and subscribe to our YouTube channel. To our YouTube channel.